Tell me about it. Oh, you're going to record it. Sure. Well, this is a so-called left ventricular assist device. Uh, many of these are just put in through the skin. This is a somewhat larger one called the Impella 5.0, and it's placed with a small surgical incision into the artery in the leg, uh, and then sewn up as it's uh, delivered into the heart. And at this point, uh, blood is sucked in through the area here, draining the heart, and it is ejected out here on the other side of the valve into the body, and the motor unit is here. It's basically a screw, uh, called an Archimedes screw, that uh, sucks in blood and uh, can deliver between two and a half to five liters per minute. And how is this an advantage over what you had been using? Well, the one that we used is purely through the skin without a cut down. It's only able to do about half the flow at two and a half liters per minute. This is almost as good as a surgically implanted left ventricular assist device as far as its volume. But the main thing is it can be put in people who are really too sick to have the surgery for a uh, surgical left ventricular assist device. Okay. So it's a, it can be used as a bridge, a bridge to see if the patient's going to get better a bridge to stabilize them and have a better perfusion to the organs so that could get better and allow them to have surgery for the, either the left ventricular assist device or a heart transplant. And about 70% of people will get better. About 30%, however, will have, need, require the full surgery to have a uh, either an LVAD or a heart transplant.